back with my unboxing video. I told you guys I was going to come back and do um, when I mentioned the old oh, baby box in the last video. Um, and about the last video, my head was not supposed to be cut off in <laughs> in the um, haul, but I recorded the um, the video the wrong way. So, lesson learned. And, um, yeah, and I know I was all comfy last time, but we just left from dinner. So, I figured I would record while I'm looking like somebody. Okay? All right. So, I'm going, I have three things I'm going to unbox. And then one thing I'm just going to share with you guys. Um, I have this Amazon, Amazon baby registry free bag. And I have this box from my insurance company. There's a couple of goodies in here. And then, of course, the old baby box. And I'm going to do everything in the order that um, I received them. Excuse my dog. She thinks she's supposed to have all my attention. Excuse me, ma'am. She's nosy. All right. So, first, the Amazon bag. We have <laughs> um, these water wipes. Um, samples. And... Um, it's supposed to be the world's purest baby wipes. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I don't really know what I should and should not be using. Probably gonna research everything before I decide to use it on my baby, so I can't say I'm gonna use it. Um, here we have Simple Joys by Carter's. It looks like it's a onesie. I didn't open it all the way because I was saving it to open with you guys. Yep, these should be special. Yep, it's a onesie. There's some little elephants on there and lions. Um, really soft. All right. And here we have uh, Huggies diaper. It looks like it may be, it's three, three of them in here. Um, yeah. And let's see, next we have a sample of drift washing powder. Uh, no babies use this. I don't have a baby, but I know this is what you're supposed to use. So we're going to use that. Hello Billo hand sanitizing spray. Definitely be using that. Muslin burp cloth. Um, just a white burp cloth. Um, I don't know if there's anything special about it. I don't know what's the good ones or what's the bad ones. Prenatal Smarty Pants formula. I won't be taking those. Um, I'm taking the one a day prenatal complete with the choline, I believe that's how you say it. And I haven't had any sickness or anything. And my doctor satisfied with those, so why fix it if it ain't broke? Okay. All right. And this is Easy Start Anti-Colic Start Pacifier. Um, it's actually a bottle. Um, it's the ideal for combining with breastfeeding, flat, soft nipples, shaped like mom's nipples. So, you know, I should have said, because I don't think that my baby's going to be on a pacifier. Yes, it's a bottle, and it does have a pacifier in there. So, who knows? We might try it out one day. And we have some Cetaphil baby wash and shampoo. I've been seeing this being recommended on the baby apps and just research I've been doing. I use Cetaphil for my face. Um, I've used it before, but I went back to it because I know it's like one of the simplest face washes you can use and moisturizers, and it's safe for being for pregnancy. Because, you know, you're supposed to try not to use things with a lot of stuff in there. So, um, CeraVe, moisturizing lotion, baby. And, and I think I said that right. If I didn't, correct me. And it's a bunch of coupons in here. And some Aquaphor Baby 3-in-1 diaper cream sample. All right. So that's everything we have from Amazon. And now we're gonna get into this blue cross box. Okay, came with the form, of course, to give my doctor. That was the first thing on the top. Um, if you have blue cross, if you feel like, have your doctor to fill out a form and show that you came to a first semester trimester um prenatal appointment, they will give you it's either fifty or seventy five dollars, and you can use that towards your copay in the end all right so gave me some little blue cross blue shield um baby socks we'll probably wear those around the house if ever uh blue cross bib 
a guide to feeding babies and toddlers. So I do plan on doing um, some at home, homemade baby foods. Y'all know I like to cook, so I'm ready to experiment. Um, so yeah, definitely will be using this. Um, these are some breastfeeding nipple pads. Um, it's by Medela, which is the breast pump they sent me as well. I already got my breast pump. Um, and these are some chew proof and rip proof, non-toxic, 100% washable books. So your baby's first books are here. And inside it has colors, um, has a few words. So I feel like this is like a sight words type book. Yeah, I'm going to see if I can maybe subscribe to get more of these. And I will let y'all know. And a little pregnancy magazine from Blue Cross. Add some recipes and things like that in there. And just information, honestly. Um, besides insurance kind of information, all of the information that they shared with me, I really learned on the app. The What's to Expect app has been my go-to. Um, yeah. So, we also have the old baby box um opening but i pre-recorded that daddy helped me do that one so just stay tuned and you will see it all right so here's our old baby box opening this is my very first one so inside it says congratulations mama let's get social it has their website information facebook instagram and how to win a free box you snap your breast photo of the old baby box, you tag them, and then they'll announce the winner monthly. So, excuse my dog, y'all. All right, so it comes with a little book. It says Mama, and this is the second trimester. Hey! Second trimester one. Um, it's just talking about how to get a free gift. So, it talks about each item that is in the box. It gives you the price, gives you a description, of everything in the box. So it basically tells you how much it's worth compared to how much you pay for the box. This box is $39.99, so I can already tell I got my money's worth because this here is 30, that's 32, $15.95. So I'm gonna use this while I'm going through the box. So it's wrapped up really nice. All right, so first we got a tote. We say tote. Prego. And the little lady just pregnant here. I'm gonna open it up. All right, and this tote was valued at $15.95. Yeah, so just a little tote. I guess you could probably like take this to your doctor's appointments or something. Or who knows? All right, so next. It's a two-step jelly mask, brightening and nutritioning. First step, APH peeling swab. And this is the step two jelly mask. It's valued at $6. So it says, give your glowing mama skin a much needed break. So I guess if I was gonna have me a little self-care night at home, and to just pamper myself, this would be good. And it's hard, I'm scared to try stuff with being pregnant. So this is gonna be good. Oh, and then it comes with some mama earrings. They're gold, and it says mama in cursive. And I, I really only wear studs for real, so this is gonna be really good. And this is value at $30, and it's 14 karat gold plated. So they shouldn't tarnish or turn either. All right. Next we have all natural baby balm. Five times more moisturizing than baby lotions, unscented, Moisturize dry skin. So I guess this is something that may be going in the baby's bag. And this is valued at $7. Yeah, so this is definitely for the baby. We might try that. So next we have this cucumber jelly belly overnight mask. I think this is for the belly. This is valued at $20. It's yes, it's a mask for your belly. It says the ultimate self-care tool when you've been waiting. Um, you ain't waiting for it because a mama's belly deserves all the TLC in the world. The mask hydrates, soothes, reduces inflammation, and helps heal damaged cells. It also helps 
minimize the appearance of stretch marks and scars. That's the part I was waiting to read. Um, yeah, so I'm definitely gonna use this. I'm not really that big yet, so. And it smells really good. Yeah. I'll let y'all smell it too. <laughs> I do smell good. All right. And then here is a flawless charcoal face scrub with activated activated bamboo charcoal. This is so good because I was looking for me a um, face scrub, but I was scared to buy anything because I don't know what I can really use. It's unscented. Yes. So, and this is valued at $15.95. So, I've already got my money back a couple of times. And this is a cleansing oil, truffle therapy. Um, and this is valued at $32 and it's a facial cleansing oil. So after a long day of work and mommy tags, it's nice to come home, relax and take off the day's worries. Um, it's a bi-phase makeup removing cleanser. And it has black winter truffle extract, sweet almond oil, ar argan oil, aloe vera, so yeah, definitely gonna be using this. I don't wear makeup that often, but when I do, I will use this. And lastly, it's uh, look like a mommy picture frame. Yeah. And this is valued, oh, it's an ultrasound photo holder and it's valued at $20. Um, I got a few ultrasound holders at this point, but yeah. Um, this is cool. I'll probably spray paint this uh, whatever color we do the nursery. Um, yeah, so I definitely will be keeping my subscription as I feel like it was worth the $39.99. And I will um, see y'all next month when I get another box. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the Oh Baby Box um, unboxing. Forgot to show you guys this is baby um baby for bump for joy sorry bump for joy is the pregnancy journal took me a minute to figure out what i liked this is the one i chose i like that fact that it has these pockets in here for ultrasounds and pictures just in case you know they start falling out in the places that it goes this actually a lot of information about mom and dad photos about mom and dad uh, family tree a lot of space for writing how you're feeling things you're experiencing during this time so great stuff for me to look back on um maybe in another pregnancy um or to compare pregnancies journeys and um also good for the baby to have to look back at when it becomes old enough um and can just see the journey that we were going through okay and i got this off amazon so i would highly highly recommend this one i haven't tried any other ones it actually accidentally sent me two. So I'll probably be gifting the other one to a mom to be. Um, yes. All right. So I know I haven't shared anything with you guys really about my first trimester. Um, and I'm going into my second one. My first trimester has been a breeze. Okay. It's really not even much to tell you guys because I am extremely blessed. I haven't had any morning sickness. I think I puked once and that was on Christmas. And I think it was just because of all the crazy things I was eating gone all day um but the worst thing i've had is indigestion at night and first i was fixing that with buffalo rock until i realized how much sugar is in it so i've just been going for um perrier um tapo chico preferably but here it's so hard to find and i like tapo chico before i was pregnant i would make ranch waters with tequila in it <laughs> but um yeah they've been really hard to find but at night i would just drink some of that lay down and go to sleep um I've been dealing with some constipation, but um, I've been trying to just increase my water intake. Um, someone told me two kiwis a day, did that, that helped a little bit, but raisins has really done a trick. And um, I just started trying date, not dates, prunes. Um, so it's been helping a little bit, a little bit. So I'll figure it out. No crazy cravings. In the beginning, I, could, I would only like spicy foods and sour foods, but that's because everything else tasted funny to me. But um, as of now, I don't really have any cravings. I was telling um, my boyfriend today that I think right now my cravings is salad. <laughs> I can probably eat a salad every day, 
all day. Oh, and in the beginning, I wanted a steak every day. I know I can't eat steaks every day, but that's all that I would want. I, I'm still not fond of chicken breasts right now. Um, I can do wings. I can do thighs if they're grilled. Um, but it's I'm just more picky, if anything. Um, but no sickness, nothing crazy. Doctor appointments have been great. We go for genetic testing this week. In the next few weeks, we go back for another appointment. And the appointment after that, we should find out our gender and then our gender reveal. All right. So I really enjoyed you guys today. I hope that you all enjoyed everything that we shared with you guys. Um, I'm going to try to put some links here if I can find them. Um, but if I can't, just um, if there's something in particular that you um, want me to find for you or a link for you, just comment below. Um, don't forget to like the video and I will see you guys next time.